Hi, my name is Seti and welcome back to another Tips and Tricks with Apps Events and Acer. In today's video, we're going to jump back into Gmail and I'm going to show you how you can save time by using a function called Templates. Now, Templates will help you to not only compose emails ahead of time, but also reuse long paragraphs that you end up using frequently whenever emailing parents or students and save them as a template. Now, before we can get started, we have to open up our Gmail. So let's go ahead and open up Gmail right here. And then once we're on Gmail, we're going to dive into the settings because at the moment, templates are not active and we have to turn this on first. So let's go ahead and click on that cogwheel and then select see all settings. Now, once here, what you're looking for is the advanced settings tab. So at the top, you can see there is advanced right here. We're going to click on that. And now we're going to enable templates. It is the second option from the top. So let's go ahead and enable that. And important to note, whenever you're changing something in the settings within Gmail, you have to click on save settings because otherwise those changes will not be saved and you'll be reverted back to the default options. So let's go ahead and click on save changes. Now we can start using templates. Now we've opened up a brand new email and we're going to start typing up our email. So here we go. Let's say that this will become our new templates that I now want to save. Once everything's typed up and you've done your formatting, the next step will be to save this as a template. And in order for us to do that, we now have to click on those three dots in the bottom right corner. So let's go ahead and click on those three dots and you will see there's now an extra option there that says templates. Now when we hover over that option, we can save this draft as a template. Now, when you select save draft as a template, you have to give it a name. So let's go ahead and click on save as a new template. And we're going to call this assembly email. This is just a template that I'm going to save for later. So let's go ahead and click on save. We can now close this and let's demonstrate how easy it is to use these templates to then start typing up emails. So let's say that I'm sending an email about an assembly each and every week or once a month. Well, I can click on compose and then before I do anything else, I go straight to those three dots. I'm going to select templates and I can now select my assembly email templates. When I click on that, everything is put into my email. I can add changes where necessary and then I can send it to my students, parents or colleagues at school. And that's how you create templates within Gmail. First, go to your settings, make sure that it's switched on within the advanced tab. Then you can use it in that three dot menu and you can save your own templates. It's going to save you time. It's going to make sure that your emails are consistent and that the formatting is consistent. Now this was another tips and tricks with Apps Events and Acer. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, make sure to share it out. Also scroll down, make sure that that button is no longer red so that you've subscribed to the channel and we will see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.